Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a Google Forms question that has multiple correct responses to it. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. This video was inspired by someone who emailed me to ask me about this. So let's say I have this question here of which of these two people have walked on the moon? And you can see the correct answer choices are listed there. And I've done this as a multiple choice question. Now the problem here is when a student goes to fill this out, he or she will only be able to select one of them. You can see there, it won't let them select multiple correct answers. So what we need to do is change this from multiple choice to check boxes. And then when a student's viewing this, he or she can select the multiple correct responses. In this case, Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin and submit it. They'll view their score and they'll see they got 10 out of 10. But let's say a student takes the quiz and they answer Neil Armstrong, but they also answered Buzz Lightyear. Let's hit submit and view the score, they'll see that they got zero out of 10, even though they did get one of the answers correct. So they should have gotten five out of 10. And that's because Google is looking for an exact match to your answer key in order to give those 10 points. So what you need to do is go into your settings for that quiz. And we can see here, you know, these are our typical settings of requiring a response. And we go to our quizzes, we've got this set as make a quiz. And we want to change this release grade from immediately after each submission to later after manual review. And that way, I can go in as the teacher and manually update the scores that my students will see. So now a student will see it this way. And let's say my student is Mason. He's going to take the quiz and he answers it this way and hits submit. He'll just see that his response has been recorded and I've left on the option to make another submission, but he doesn't see his score. So, as the teacher, I need to go into the responses now, and I'm going to score these individually. Let's go to our last response. There's Mason's, and I'm going to change that from zero out of 10 to five out of 10, and then I'm going to release that score to Mason. He's gonna get an email, and he'll get the score. So that's how you can create a question in Google Forms that has multiple correct responses. As always, more tips and tricks like this, please subscribe to my YouTube channel or visit freetechforteachers.com.